Hi, Michelle. This is Nick. We met on the Facebook Flooring Installation Group, and this is your complimentary website audit. I'm going to go through in about five minutes your site, one of the competitor sites, and some things that you can do yourself in order to get more business, to get more leads when people are doing a Google search. So let's start out. Looking at your page here, I want to point out the phone number on the top right. You want this to be what's known as a click to call. It's uh, fairly straightforward to change that. So what happens is if someone's sitting on their phone looking at your site, they just click this and it calls. Even on a computer, they can click it and it calls. It makes it a lot more favorable for someone to just click and call you rather than to have to type it in, okay? Looking at the content that I see on your site, Google loves content, okay? Right now, they prefer sites that have 2,000 or more words on the homepage. That makes you a subject matter expert. As you can tell here, you don't have that many words, but content is king. So right here, if we're talking about wall tiles, cabinets, countertops, hardware, all the things that you can help someone get, all the things that you can outsource, we want content written about that. Hopefully that makes sense. Scrolling down a little bit, the images that you have here, the light flooring, the other light flooring, a couple of the others light hardwood, you want these to be ones that can be opened up, right? Rather than just an image, let those be opened up so someone can explore your site and learn a little bit more. So that's a little bit about the site that you've got right here. I don't see anything as far as services. I see a book online. Clicking the book online, I understand it's got it right here, flooring consultation, measurements, etc. We'll want to have, again, more content behind this. I would suggest here at the top, uh, basically a services page, okay? Looking now at a Google search. Searching by your name. You definitely come up for your name, which is the way that it should be. And on the right here, this is something called a GMB or a Google My Business listing. It looks as though you've claimed this. That's what you do. But what you'll want to do is put in a lot more photos, okay? This is basically Google reserving some space for you and you wanna optimize this as soon as possible. Hours, you want more reviews here, etc. This is pretty straightforward. I can help you with this. Going to the next area, this is our tool. This tool is called AREFs. It's fairly expensive at about a thousand dollars a month, but what it tells is how you're going to perform and in the past, how you have performed. Just getting a water there. So besides content, Google looks at something called backlinks. Backlinks, think of those as links from other credible sites, preferably in the same niche, back to yours, almost like a popularity contest. So that this way, if you've got all of the content, right? And now you have backlinks of other sites saying, hey, Floor Studs is the site to go to. This is where you'd have the backlinks. You don't have any now, and backlinks are usually tied to keywords. So if we click on here, let me log back in. I apologize, I've been out for a little bit, but this will just take a second. Let's do this. Okay, and what I'm going to show you here is those keywords that we were talking about. You only have one keyword right now. I'm gonna show you a competitor and a way to take some of their keywords, right? So looking at the keyword here, there's just the one, and it's someone types in floor studs. Even there, you're in the 37th position. And what this means for this particular keyword is 40 people search it a month, okay? Difficulty is zero to 100. Typically under 20 is easier. That's what you wanna go for. This is an 18. But right now you're in the 37th position, so not getting any traffic. So let's take a look at something. Let's say that I want to do flooring in Irvine, California. I want to be specific to your area, although you may service outside of Southern California or Irvine. Let's use this as an example. So I type in flooring, Irvine, California, and you're not going to be in the top 100. And this is one of these areas that you definitely want to be in the top 100. Let me show you here. If I were to type in flooring, Irvine, California, and check, you're not in the top 100. If you're not on the first page, you're not going to get the traffic. What happens is when someone is doing a search, be it for flooring or plumbing or any home maintenance service, and that's all that we specialize in helping clients in, the home maintenance niche, 
If you're not on the first page, you're not going to be found. What you want to be is you want to be the first, let's say, flooring services provider that looks trustworthy on the first page. That's what someone's going to click. So going back to this Google search, right? Here's the, one of the first ones that come up naturally, oflooring.com. Okay, let's take a look at what their site looks like. And you can see here, it's got the click to call like I've mentioned. It's got a lot more content, okay? And really, it's got some behind the scenes. I can click on a piece of flooring and you can see how much of a description it provides. And the great thing is, just like appliances, you can put down all of this information just from the packaging. It will give you more credibility. It'll help people on your site shop a little bit better. And now let's go to the overview and AREFs of their flooring site. Take a look at this, 4,000 backlinks. Not that you need to get there, but you don't have any. Even 10 or 20 will make a difference. You've got no one coming to your site right now through an organic search, through your keywords, content, backlinks. What if we could change that? 30, 40, 80 people a month coming to your site. And through which keywords? Let's take a look. It's not difficult at all to take some of their some of their keywords, right? Tuscany floor, 200 searches for Tuscany floor, right? They're number five. They're getting 20 people their site just off Tuscany floor. So what we want to do for you or what you can do yourself is find the keywords with the highest volume, right? 100 searches for American Guild flooring, zero keyword difficulty. They're getting 42 hits on their site. So that's what we want to do. Let's wrap up here. So, Michelle, increase the content on the site. 2,000 plus words on the homepage, right? To be found in Google searches. And again, the products that you sell, put those descriptions on the site. That will help. It'll also give your clients a better idea of what they're buying. Implementing backlinks. You don't have any now, but high volume keywords like flooring, Irvine, California. Lastly, we didn't get into it, but you Google My Business. If you have enough citations behind that, simply entries in various directories are on the web. Think about it like entries in different uh, phone books and such, right? That will also help you get traffic to your site. So I want to say thank you, Michelle, very much. Pleasure meeting you in the Facebook group. Um, these things you can do on your own. If you want uh, help at all, I'm happy to help out. And we'll talk to you soon. Thanks. Bye-bye.